Good morning! This is Rose Domingo and welcome to my YouTube channel. This morning I have a new topic to share and this is all about the five foods to eat if you have COVID-19 infection. There's an important relationship among your nutritional status, immune health, risk of infection, and ability to recover from illness. Poor nutrition is associated with inflammation and oxidative stress, which comprise immune health. Both inflammation and oxidative stress are elevated when you have COVID-19. The World Health Organization declared the novel coronavirus a pandemic in March 2020 and the virus full name is Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome Coronavirus Open Close Parenthesis SARS does cov does 2 and the illness it causes is called COVID-19. COVID-19 negatively affects nutritional status because it decreases appetite and may limit your access to nutritious foods during confinement. Yet, it simultaneously increases your body's need for nutrients such as vitamin D. Diet and nutrition can help support your immune health if you have COVID-19, especially if you consume foods with antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties. It's important to note that this is an emerging area of research. These foods won't prevent you from contracting the novel coronavirus or cure the disease, but they have been shown to support immune health. This article I have read list key nutrients, foods, and nutrition practices that may be beneficial for people who have COVID-19 or are covering from it. Number one is vitamin D. Vitamin D is the most frequently discussed micronutrient among nutrition experts for the management of COVID-19. This fat-soluble vitamin and hormone exerts an anti-inflammatory effect by suppressing overactivity of the immune system, according to the newer and older research. In the body, vitamin D acts an angiotensin, converting enzyme to open close parenthesis ACE2 a protein receptor found in the lungs and fat tissues the novel coronavirus binds to ACE2 at the beginning of an infection potentially leading to acute respiratory distress syndrome and severe illness in people with COVID-19 However, vitamin T interacts with the ACE2 receptors, potentially preventing the virus from binding to them and reducing complications associated with COVID-19. Vitamin D also play a protective role and support healing of damaged tissues, primarily in the lungs. Foods to eat on average, people make approximately 80% of their vitamin D when their skin is exposed to sunlight, ultraviolet light, and get the remaining 20% from their diet. 
As a result, taking vitamin D daily may be a good idea if you are in confinement due to COVID-19 and have little sunlight exposure. However, some medications may interact with vitamin D supplements, including blood thinners, which are common among people with COVID-19 as a result of the increased risk of blood clotting. That's why it's best to speak with a healthcare professional before you start taking vitamin D supplements regularly. Increasing your intake of vitamin D rich foods while you have or are recovering from COVID-19 is a great way to reduce the risk of a vitamin D deficiency and potentially improve your immune response. There are seven foods rich in vitamin D along with the amount of the vitamin it contains. Cut liver oil, 170% of the daily volume per one teaspoon. Herring, 27% of daily per 100 grams. Egg yolk, 27% of the DV per 100 grams, sardine 24% of the DV per 100 grams, canned light tuna 34% of the DV per 100 grams, salmon wild caught or farmed 66% of the DV per 100 grams, fortified orange juice 25% of the DV per 100 grams. Whilst wild mushrooms are a vegetarian source of vitamin D, their levels vary depending on the type of light they were exposed to as they were growing, according to older research. Summary Vitamin D may help protect your lungs during novel coronavirus infection by disrupting viral attachment in your body. Several foods are rich in vitamin D, including cod liver oil, salmon, herring, and some wild mussels. Number two, carotenoids and vitamin A. Carotenoids are antioxidants as well as pigments, red, green, yellow, and orange. They're found in nature in some colorful algae, bacteria, fungi, plants, fruits, and vegetables, some of which you can include in your diet. Of the 700 carotenoids identified in nature, only about 30 have been found in human body. One of these is vitamin A and is precursor beta-carotene. Vitamin A is a fat-soluble antioxidant carotenoid. It has anti-inflammatory properties and research has shown it may be beneficial for managing pneumonia and respiratory infections. In the case of COVID-19, studies indicate that vitamin A reduces inflammation and oxidative stress enhances the immune response and may decrease the severity of the disease. Researchers think it protects the ACE2 receptors similarly to vitamin D and may work in several other molecular targets to combat COVID-19. Some people may develop vitamin A deficiency during infections as such as COVID-19, and this may actually increase the severity of the disease. If this happens, you might need to take vitamin A supplements. However, drug interactions are also possible if you're taking vitamin A supplements, so make sure you speak with a healthcare professional before taking them. Foods to eat. Dark green leafy vegetables Organ meats, particularly liver, and are rich sources of vitamin A. 
Here are eight foods rich in vitamin A along with the percentage of TV per 100 grams of each. Beef liver, 5-5% of the TV. Chicken liver, 3-27% of the TV. King mackerel, 24% of the TV. Goat cheese, 54% of the TV. Sweet potato cooked. 87% of the DV Colliard greens 28% of the DV Carrots raw 93% of the DV Baby spinach raw 31% of the DV Summary Vitamin A is a carotenoid which may help provide powerful protection against infections including COVID-19 Food sources include liver dark green leafy vegetables and pigmented vegetables such as sweet potato and carrots number three zinc zinc deficiency has been associated with an increased risk of infections and poorer outcomes in those with covid19 zinc is regarded as one of the most important minerals research shown that its antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties may reduce the risk of heart disease, may support eye health, and are essential for immune health. In COVID-19, zinc may reduce the risk of getting a bacterial infection at the same time and decrease activity of the ACE2 receptors, which are targets of the novel coronavirus. It also protects the health of the lung tissue and may be a therapeutic additional treatment for COVID-19. Food to eat. Ground beef, 41% of the DV. Dark chocolate, 70-85%. to 85%. Cacao, 30% of the DV. Seafood oyster, can 73% of the DV. Cashew nuts, 53% of the DV, hemp seeds, 90% of the DV, pumpkin seeds, 71% of the DV, lentils, sprouted raw, 14% of the DV. Summary Zinc is an essential mineral with anti inflammatory properties that may benefit people with COVID 19. Rich food sources include ground beef, cashew, and hemp seeds. Number four is omega-3 fatty acids. Omega-3 polysaturated fats are a category of fatty acids shown to have in anti-inflammatory health benefits including for brain health, heart disease, and rheumatoid arthritis. However, higher quality research in humans needed before healthcare professionals may recommend taking for this purpose. Omega-3 fats reduce inflammation and the potential for the cytokine storm in COVID-19 which is hyperacidity of the immune system that causes negative symptoms. They are thought to do this by becoming part of the cell membranes of various tissues throughout the body and preventing the production of pro-inflammatory compounds. Another potential benefit of omega-3 fats in treating those with recovering from COVID-19 is their role in improving mood, anxiety, and depression, all of which may be worsened by the novel coronavirus pandemic. Foods to eat Chia seeds 6% of 100 grams Soybean dry roasted 1.4 grams per 100 grams Sardines can 4.98 per 4.98 milligrams per 100 grams. Cut beaver oil 9.35 mg per tablespoon. King mackerel 159 per 100 grams. Flaxseed 23 grams per 100 grams. Walnuts 9 grams per 100 grams. Salmon 113 milligrams per 100 grams. Summary Omega 3 Polysaturated fats are known for their anti inflammatory health benefits and may help 
treat COVID-19. Food sweets in omega-3 packs include salmon, sardines, and chia seeds. Number five, vitamin C. Vitamin C is an antioxidant vitamin that supports immune health in people of all ages. Animal and human studies have found that vitamin C may reduce oxidative stress, improve of the DV, kiwi raw 130 percent of the DV, cauliflower raw 54 percent of the DV, and canned tomatoes 14 percent of the DV. Sweet pepper red. 142% of the DV. Papaya raw, 68% of the DV. Summary, vitamin C is an antioxidant vitamin that supports immune health and is known to reduce the risk of pneumonia. This nutrient shows promise as a treatment for COVID-19 and more research is currently underway. The bottom line, COVID-19 negatively affects nutritional status and the healthy functional immune system is paramount to reducing the risk of infection and supporting recovery. Researchers are looking with great interest at vitamin D, carotenoids, vitamin A, zinc, omega-3 fatty acids, and vitamin C to determine their potential health benefits as complementary treatments for COVID-19. There is currently no clinical evidence that a low histamine diet is beneficial to those with or recovering from COVID-19. More research in humans is needed. Okay, that's all for today's video and thank you so much for watching. I will also put the link in my description box for us to read more about these foods that are that beneficial for COVID-19 patients. Bye for now. See you on the next one. God bless and bye-bye. Smile.